cheddar and I hope you're ready for the best potato recipe of the year all right nice quantity of cheddar over here so I'm cooking for three but you can make uh, for how many people you're cooking all right perfect I have some bacon some super crispy bacon huh here it is all right we're gonna put this beautiful bacon right in there just like that you see you crisp it up with your hand you make your real bacon bits for real you know how they say real bacon bits these are the real bacon bits now press it because we're not done yet right if this is the best of the year you know we gotta you know we gotta earn that title right look at this okay over here I have some eggs and this one me one milk frother you see you just froth it a little bit because why use a whisk when you can use a frother right look at that super easy all the egg whites incorporated all right now that it froze this beauty look at that a nice egg cream here just eggs you know we pour these gorgeous eggs you see just a bit right in there voila beautiful there we go okay now it's gonna go down because of the cheese you know but just fill it up a little bit all right we come in now with some ham diced ham look at this gorgeous look at this gorgeous ham look at this we put some of this beautiful ham in here look at how gorgeous it looks there you go put a nice ham in there all right this recipe is so easy you just need the time to boil the potato and that's it look at this all right now there you go you see if they break like this here you just close them like that because it's like play-doh now we want to put some pepper of course only just a little bit for that extra you know peppery flavor in there beautiful and you can skip this but i like to top this with a little bit more of my cheddar cheese just a little bit to make a nice melted crust just like that or juice i can't wait to try this all right but we're not done now huh? bear with me look at this beautiful that's it now let's just bake this in the oven at 350 for just 10 15 minutes we have some idaho potatoes that i cut over here now for this beautiful recipe here Parmesan grated, all right? You want the grated, the good stuff. Put it in, into the bowl or in there. We come with some garlic powder. You can use granulated, whatever you want. All right, and food to taste, all right? I like a lot, so I'm gonna put about this much. I have some Italian seasoning. Make sure it got the oregano, right? Oregano is what we want here. All right, about this much. That gives a nice flavor, right? Crushed red peppers, okay? Baby. Give it a nice left, wix him up. Black pepper, pull how much you like. I like a lot with four L's. A lot. There you go. That's it. Now we just whisk this goodness. We don't need no salt, we don't need no anything. That's our perfect mix ready for our recipe, which we're gonna do now. Okay, so we're gonna have this glass trailer here, 13 by 9, and I have a stick of melted butter. You can use oil, but I recommend the butter. Because of course, put it in butter. And make sure you got like a nice layer, all right? Not too much. And don't worry, like this is gonna get cold, but oh, it's perfect. As long as it don't get too firm, you'll be fine. There you go. Look at that. Let's put those those juices too here. Perfect. Now you see our beautiful mixture we did. Here, check this out. Look how beautiful it is. Smells like Italy. There you go. Okay, we gently do this operation right here. Spread all the parmesan, you know, and the seasoning on the butter. All right, make sure you you know you cover all the, the places you, uh, you know that's missing there you go perfect 
look at this gorgeous right and don't use like the 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 cheese you, you don't buy you know from the fridge right you know that that the craft parmesan don't use this stuff because that doesn't doesn't melt even all right perfect now look at those potatoes you see this beautiful now i'm gonna put it like this but if you want you can do like you know your crease crots so you know it goes even better but we don't have time for that right this is easy beautiful recipes right without time you know to make nothing complicated because you know who get time for that we got all the jobs right we're gonna make delicious we're gonna save time right maximum uh reward for minimum effort right there you go work smart not hard okay look at this gorgeous oh my goodness all right and now before we go in the oven I have here the butter remaining. All right, we're gonna brush these gorgeous potatoes, right? I added a little bit of oil, because I didn't have much left, but it, you know, it doesn't matter if which one you use, oil. You know, just to make that nice crust on top of your gorgeous potatoes, right? Perfect. Look at this, gorgeous. Now, if you want, now is the time to add some salt, right? I still have a little bit left, that's all I'm gonna eat. Perfect, you know, just to make the crust nice and salty. All right, and we just bake this till they're cooked. Depends how big are your potatoes. I say for this, about 25 minutes, 350. See you later. Wow, wow, wow. Take a peek wow. at this gorgeousness. Look at All that. Right. This is how you eat it, look at this. I come here, have some parsley, you just roughly chop a little bit of parsley, some worst, of course. There you go, just a little bit, yeah. Look at all that nice parsley, look how gorgeous this is. There you go. Now, I take a plate. Okay, here, let me show you. Let me show you what we're dealing with, all right? So, roll up your sleeves and get comfortable. All right, look at this. Look at that. Beautiful, nice and crunchy. Here, let's see another one. There you go, here, make, make sure, make, there you go. Now, look at this. Wow. Look at these beautiful potatoes here. So good. Look at that. I'm gonna grab another one for you to show. There we go. Yeah. Perfect, whoop. And now, you see, perfectly cooked. Look how tender they are. Mm. Wow. Wow, wow, wow! Crispy parmesan. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Wow, wow, wow. I'm so happy. Look at this gorgeousness. Wow. Alright. Now, this is how we eat. Look. See how crispy it is here? Wow. Nice and crispy. Okay, now let's put it on a plate. And I have here some light sour cream. Okay, now I've been told you put this on top. So let's put a little bit here. Not the prettiest, but okay, it will work. Now some the finely diced yeah. red onions and some chives. There you go. The bacon is already inside. All right, let's cut this open. Let's see how it looks in there. Look at this. One, two, three. <gasps> Look at this piece of art. Yeah. Oh my God, you see all the cheddar, the eggs, the ham, the bacon. Ah, mm. here, I cannot wait anymore. Woo, now I cut it straight, but if you pull it like the cheese will, we'll do a, a cheese pull. Ah, it's hot. <laughs> mm. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Mm. Just wow. Wow. Mmm.